Hello and welcome back dear friends, it's me Odo. I'm back in my campaign of EU4 with the Oman. Um, last time we took a bit of land from uh, Fars at this coastline and the <coughs> and the, what's it called? Um, fort here in Thassa. And I was uh, evaluating our position in between episodes. Um, we will need a lot of admin because uh, we want to take as a next idea group religious idea. So what we will need is we will need to level up admin to tech 14 as fast as possible and um, take the religious idea group as fast as possible. Um, so we should not be careless with our admin points. So I don't want to um, take too much land for myself, <clears throat> but um, so I need to take the land with my um, vassal. I only have two vassals, and the Rassids. The Rassids are nearly, nearly done. They just need these two provinces, and they are full. They don't have any potential anymore. I mean, they just can go up to the Mamluks here, and that's it. And Mushasha only needs Samawat. Then they are also full. I was thinking, probably, probably, that I could take a jam as an as as an as a vessel. They are really, really, really weak right at the moment. They're at war with Fars, who are also rather weak at the moment. Um, I hope that we could take a jump as a vessel. If we are lucky, we can take them as a vessel while they are still at war with Fars and then uh, take even more money from Fars. But I'm not sure if we will be able to take them as a vessel because they are still, re I mean, they were really, really big uh, some time ago. But now they are just spread out somewhere. <laughs> I mean, this is terrible. But they have a lot of claims. Really a lot of claims. I mean, here, uh, half of the Timurid Empire in Fars, in Arakoyunlu, in Musha, okay, we don't need to claim in Mushasha. They have claims up there in Transoxiana and in Delhi. How, how did they come to these claims? What, what's that? Why do they have claims in Delhi? I really don't know. Military access from Olodia. Yeah, why not? Go ahead. You will be killed anyway by Ethiopia. So I really don't care. They won't attack me. They are they are just um too weak right now. So I mean we could take a really fast war with a jam. I mean we should do this because they they don't have any allies, they uh, don't have any troops, they're down to 6,000 troops. I'm not sure if we can vassalize them, but we will try to. If we can't vassalize them, we don't take land. Or we give the land to Mushasha, like um, these, these provinces we could take, we could give to Mushasha. Yeah. 
Let's confirm this. You take the leader and go here. They still have a wall with, yeah, they still have a wall with Fars. That's great. It's possible to, um, to demand the vassalization of them. No, go away, Fars. Oh, on the other hand, it's okay. It's okay, Fars. Just take what you like. We will vassalize them anyway. So what's that? Um, Ulima gain loyalty and influence, or Ulima gain influence. Uh, okay. Well, let's. Ah, also, can we? No, because we are at war. Ugh, I'm stupid. Just forgot. We, we we shouldn't forget it. And move from them. Hey, we got a wall bridge. That's new. And they don't stop here. They go to us. That's nice. So that's this. Take the guy. Go up here. Do you still have any forts left? Up here, Biapas, Karabakh, Karakoyumdu. Doesn't look like that. A jump in the fort. And there is a fort right there. Oops. Okay, that's okay. We've got time. I wanted to look if we could vassalize him. Wait, what? <sighs> okay, we'll accept. I don't want to fight Mamluks. <sighs> Come here, boys and girls. Will the Mamluks also... ...intervene in the war with Farf? Hmm? Hmm? Will they? I hope no, they can't because Fars is not a great power like us. Ugh, I hate Mamluks. I really hate them. Hmm. Anyway, if Fars takes part of of Ajam, it's even easier to um to advise them. Hmm. We should look for another vessel. How about you? Ooh, two provinces here. Can we attack you? Yep. But not you. Okay, how about attacking Vijayalagar? 
if we attack Vijayanagar, we are at war with these guys as well. We could vassalize them. Or these guys. No. Mm, no. Nah. We could vassalize them. Because they have claims on two provinces in Gujarat. That's good. We want to go to war with them in the near future. Because we really don't like them. Although they would like an alliance with us. Interesting. But they are allied with the Timurids. We don't like the Timurids. We could also try to vassalize Gujarat, but I'm not sure if we will be able to do this anyway. With these guys, we could take this and later on more of Gujarat. We need more. Um, strongholds in um, in India. Hmm. I mean, they really hate us because, I mean, they don't give any thing here because of the missionary guy. Uh, let's see. How about you getting back here? No. Getting here. And you going down here? No, we can't move through Yemen. So if Tavasir revolts, we need to go around all this way. So let's move to Moscow. Okay, we still need some troops. Okay, we do this. Province, core, province, core, province. Yay! And yeah, these were provinces that we already had cause on. Oh, that were already states. Protests in Lamu. We can gain legalism. The Mawu like us more or mysticism. And get local unrest plus five. Oh, that's too good. So what's that? Um, acquire subject, conquer state. State maintains harsh treatment. No, harsh treatment is better. Gain 50 admin. It's good. We admin points. Build a treasury. Oh, we got the conquest of something already. So, after we conquered Arden and Basra, wait, we could declare war on you. Hmm. Take Patra and start integrating Mushasha and the rest. It's more or less the same time. Hmm. Interesting thought. Interesting thought. I 
don't think that the Mamluks would intervene for Karakujunglu because they don't like it. Not sure if um, the Ottomans would probably intervene, but I don't think they like the uh, Karakujunglu either. So, hmm. Why can't I? Yeah, there it is. Hmm. Hmm. Probably let's do this. Not choose with the Congo has ended. Okay. I really couldn't care less. Okay, um, let's do this for a while. And you try to to suppression of rebels um still a lot of rebels here could look at Ooh, fancy. We got rid of the Basangali. Rebels. Even separated. Notched separated. Hmm. Like in Bagamoyo. Where is that? And then Tango. this. I mean, it's autonomy, but I really don't want to. I really don't want these guys to, to rebel. <laughs> oh, wait, what? No witness or loyalty? Mm, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, whatever. Innovativeness is good. We like innovative. So, how about you and this thing going on? Now. Mm -hmm. 
How is my How is my Okay. Let's see, how is my a lot of stupid things here? Ooh. We've got prosperity here. No, we don't have prosperity in Mocha. That's that. But we have prosperity here in Africa. Interesting. And we also build up prosperity here. Hmm. I mean, we will need some faults here, probably. Like a fort here in Bagai Moyo. Let's see. Do we have any fort here? No. We have a fort in Bagamoyo. It also protects Zanzibar and Tanga. And then we need one in Malindi. Hmm. Oh, that's good. Let's get a port here. And one here. Or probably we don't. How about here? Nope. How about now? So, ah, uh, what was this? Ah, uh, I didn't read it. So how about we declare war now? Um, is this a good idea? I mean, 1911-4. We have more cannons. We have less horses, but much more infantry. I mean, we only have 34,000 troops here. And he's got 34,000 troops also. But yeah, where's Gidan? With that up here. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. But first, we start for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, and we'll see each other again soon, I hope. Until then, bye.